So I'm standing here at French Prairie Gardens and I'm here with Stacy. And Stacy, we're gonna talk about some of these wonderfully cool new varieties that you have in your hanging basket. Yes, yes, so every year we look at our combinations and see how they do. Um, and then we like to put in new things. So this one's the Starry Sky Burgundy. Wow. A lot like the Night Sky, which is purple, and the Pink Sky that's pink. This is a brand new one. It's got great habit, nice trailer, and great color. And I love that, that to me, through my vision of looking at them, they really look like velvet. Oh, I mean, yeah. They're stunning. Yeah, and each one has a different time that it'll it'll start with little, bit of, little bitty specks, and then it'll go bigger ones. Um, so it just kind of depends on where it is in the maturity level of the flower. Right, which is one of the cool things about them is they're not just always the same. They actually change as they grow. Yes, yes. And also, as the heat gets more intense, the less the spots start. So you might see them more in the spring and more in the fall. It just kind of depends on our weather in Oregon. Wow, that's, and that's a fascinating thing. And is there any other new things that you brought in this year? Oh, yes, yes. We have all sorts of different varieties of new million bells and new bacopa. So it just kind of depends on what you're looking for, but we have it. Wonderful. And then, you know, what I love too about you guys is you do such a great job of growing these. So once we get these beautiful things to our own homes, what do we do for care? Well, we want to make sure we water it every day, sometimes twice a day. And the key to watering really well is to make sure it goes through the bottom of the pot. Right. We want to make sure those roots get nice and wet. You want to see it actually yes. drain. Yeah, okay. yeah. A lot of people will get fooled because it'll flow over the top of the pot and then the bottom stays dry. Right. And then they don't know what's wrong with their flowers. So right. we want to right. make sure that their roots are nice and wet. Uh, but we don't want to overwater them, so it's kind of tricky. You got to have that nice balance. And I'm sure that all, that all depends too on the actual temperature that we're getting into at yes, the time of yeah, year. Yeah, yeah. As it gets into summer, we get those really, really hot temperatures. We want to make sure we watch them and water them twice right. or sometimes right. three times a day. Yeah, it's the price we pay for beauty, isn't yes. it? Yes. Oh, yes. But then you also love, and I do. I bought this last time. I really like this fertilizer. Yes. You guys yeah. In that. Yep. Jack's Triple Twenty is our favorite. Uh, we recommend everybody does it once a week for their baskets to keep them going. And the great thing about this triple 20 blend is it keeps the growth going, but then it also keeps the blooms. So nice. it's not just like a blossom one where it's just full and tight. We want them to also be long. So it's a general purpose yeah. that touches mm -hmm. all of it. Yeah. Yeah. And then let's talk about Mother's Day. Tell me what's going on. We have our Mother's Day brunch, which is great. Uh, we make everything here from scratch. Uh, we have pastries, we have ham, we have quiches, all sorts of goodies. Uh, you need to make reservations online, so special treat for mom. And then each person who comes for our brunch, they get a coupon that they can use in the garden center. Wonderful. Um, and then even Saturday before, we're going to do a painting class. Nice. Yeah, so people can come, and if they if they do, if they already have plans on Mother's Day for brunch, they can come here and do a painting class with mom. Well, you know, I have to tell you that last Mother's Day, I actually brought my own mother here and it was absolutely stunning. The food was delicious. It was just a blast. So I would suggest you go to gardentime.tv. We'll pop you over to their website, sign up for this wonderful event, bring your mother and just have a beautiful Mother's Day. Thank you so much. It was, it's really lovely. Oh, thanks, William. <laughs>